Hello, hello, welcome to Hello Stream 2021. Can you believe it? Has it really been 12 months? How is everyone Happy feeling? Hello Stream, everybody. Is everything spoils and ghouls, <laughs> etc. Yeah, welcome to the scariest game level of all time. I'm told, Mike. Yes, tells me. So I'm, well, I'm I'm told as well. I've never played it before. So, um, yeah. shall I shall I reveal There's what it is? There's not a lot to see. Yeah. yeah, I mean. Well, first of all, let's say the hello scariest to chat. thing to okay. the human mind. It's the unknown. Mm, some people in it the chat like will know. Tree bark. Mm, I think some people in the chat will probably know. Yeah. How is the chat doing? Oriol Gonzalez says it's the Eve. The so, Eve. <laughs> well, it might there's, be. There's the guess. It could it might be. be. It might well be. Well, happy Halloween stream, everyone. Welcome mm. to two weeks of terror on Outside Xbox and Outside Extra. This is the inaugural stream of Halloween stream 2021. Mm. And for the record, Disney Plus, if you're watching, we had it first. Oh, yeah, have they called right. their thing Halloween stream. Yeah, yes. Disney Plus's Halloween season is called Hello Stream. Well, I think Disney we should Plus. take Disney to court, and I'm convinced we'll win. Disney <laughs> can make it up to us by uh, commissioning an Ox Venture animated series. Then, the ultimate then we're even. story is yes. us suing Disney. Yeah. <laughs> then we're even. Like that, Hello Stream. like that company that made <laughs> made the PlayStation 5 panels and said, go on then, so, so, Sony, try and sue us. And then Sony it would be more like if we made Sony our own scene. Mickey Mouse, though. In that, to parallel hey. that scenario, it would be like if we made our own off-brand Mickey Mouse. Yeah. Mickey and Mouse said, Come comes. And sue us, Disney. Mickey Mouse becomes public domain in like two years. Great. Really? Yeah. Well, we'll have All our right. revenge on in Hallow Stream yeah. Six. Yeah. Hallow <laughs> Stream Six. Mickey's revenge. Yeah. Our new D and D character, Mickey Mouse, is <laughs> <laughs> just does stuff. Cool. And they can't do anything about it. Shall I reveal well, this level? What do you reckon? Yes. Let's so, see it. Okay, I was going to beg for some likes, but uh, oh yeah, Mike's do that, got, do that. Mike's I'm not looking too around. Too much dignity to uh, beg. No, no, I don't. No, I don't. And people beg have away. already figured it out. <laughs> yeah. People have already figured it out. So right. this uh, is a level that's a support, uh, purportedly very, very scary mm. in a game that's not even a horror game, but supposedly Whoa. the scariest level of all time. Is and we're going in right there, and yeah. it's the Shell Bridge. Look at it. Shell Bridge Cradle. Yeah. Which is but some Thief kind is not of a horror game, Mike. I don't know. Kind of asylum in Thief. But it's a why you chose It's a dark and gloomy sort of game, and um. It's and a steal them up. Yeah, it is a steal them up. But yeah, this How is scary. Can it possibly be? Well, that's why it was such an effective scary level because people weren't anticipating something quite so horrifying. Um, okay. So I would have anticipated it a bit stepping yeah. up to this level. It's got all the hallmarks of a creepy I mean, coral place. Right? It's got creepy trees, lots of dead trees. It's, it's got boarded, boarded up, up door, spooky looking door. Mm. Jay Cotter only... in the chat says, "Ready to be terrified? You amazing people been catching up on all the spooks from last year to prepare." Yeah, mm. good. It's only day one of the, the first two weeks of Hallow Stream. So yeah, we need we're kind of building up with the scares. So we're starting with this thief which, game, which, which isn't is going to be scary. Yeah. <laughs> Pretty sure it's not going to be scary at all. What? Beyond Brooks says, "Hi friends, I'm so excited for this, and it's so good scared. to see you." But it's two a.m., so I should probably sleep. I'll catch the vod <laughs> later. Sending regards in the meantime. Okay. So, regards That's from Beyond Brook. And meanwhile, AG Peth says, "Happy Halloween! Can I get a birthday shout out, please?" Happy Absolutely, birthday. happy okay. birthday! Happy birthday. Oct October birthdays. So do you want a little bit of background as to why yes, I'm please. at the, the Shellbridge Cradle and what the Shellbridge yeah, Cradle me. is? Yeah, um, yeah, why are we here in this dreadful place? So, you know, I think probably it was this place was always destined to be haunted because I think it started out as an orphanage and then right. they changed it to an asylum and now it's haunted. Uh, big okay. surprise there because that's how, you know, those are two of the classic horror tropes. And before that, it was a doll factory. Yeah. And before, and before that, that, it was it built was... on a burial ground yeah. of some yeah. sort. Mm -hmm. um, that sort of thing. Uh, and before so... that, a meteorite fell on it. Yeah. yeah. A terrible murder happened <laughs> 10 years ago this very night. Um, and, uh, and so you're sent there basically to uh, investigate some uh, basically the game calls her a hag but you were sort of attacked by a, a hag personal. yeah i know <laughs> a bit rude um Dang. and right. and yeah. you've come here to just investigate more about the hag so it's we're, a just, thief. we're just we're just here we're going to thieve things well, as a thief we're always looking to thieve things jane but okay, there's not um, going to be much to thieve in an abandoned orphanage slash no asylum mm. okay we'll go and check out the front door shall i go and knock see on it can, and see if, see if we can walk yeah see if maybe there maybe it's just someone with a very particular aesthetic who lives here, and they'll just let us in. He's my just you'd like to live in. My door. Hmm. Well, I mean, that, does, that does seem boring. Use your thief's tools. Like a flash yeah. bomb. Yeah, like a flash bomb. What's this? What's this thing? What was that directly behind my head there? What do you mean directly behind my head? What are there's, you talking about? There's behind, behind Andy's head. Behind me. There's a bit of interface is. behind Andy's oh, head. Oh, it's what a is it? it's a flash bomb. It's a flash bomb. Andy, there we go. Yeah. There's a flash bomb just hiding right behind All Andy. Right, yeah, flash, okay. 
But that I, goes off, I'm going to be all blinded. I so. don't really want to use a flash bomb right now. Um, okay. In the chat, Exum says, just want to thank you for all the content over the years, especially for helping keeping me sane while I've been in hospital this last month. Have some Halloween sweets on me. Well, hey, thanks. Hope you're doing all right, Exhumed. After you're staying in hospital, thanks for the Halloween sweets. I'm eating some, uh, what are they called? Swizz, swizzles? Swizzles. Oh, yeah. Fizzers. Fizzers. You know, those like tiny, yeah, tiny yeah, yeah. fizzy sweets. I've got some yeah. sour spiders for later on, maybe. Oh, nice. But, oh, nice. Um, yeah. um, Go for Gold says, first donation ever. Best channel on YouTube. Whoa. Happy Hello Stream. Reader makes some spooky noises. Uh, okay. <laughs> Pretty good. Pretty good spooky noises. Good. Get it on the soundboard. <laughs> so, uh, I found a trap door. How are we feeling about the trap door? What do you reckon? Shall I open I mean, it? Is there another way in? Is this one of those games in? where you can find many ways in, or is this the way in? No, it's one of those games where there's walls that are connected to the building, so you can't go oh. anywhere really other ah. than in this direction. Got it, got it. So. It's a special thief level. Yeah. Okay. So, all right, well then I guess let's go into the basement, or all right. the cellar, or the dungeon. I've opened it. Rep Kyle is celebrating the season by running a Halloween campaign for their alien RPG players. Oh, nice. dope. Alien's always spooky. Yeah. When is it not spooky with an alien around? Okay, I'm creeping. Okay, so, I'm creeping. Uh, this is a bad start because you're in the basement. Mm. Everyone knows the basement is the scariest room. It's the spookiest the room of the, of the house, yeah. Uh, Except the sub-basement. If you've got a sub-basement. Oh, the, the basement. basement basement, yeah. That's like a basement multiplier. Well, there's a staircase going up there. Yeah, but I'm, I thought I'd have a look around this floor first. I mean, mm. you're like the one driving. Way. Yeah, I am. Shay Gray says, hey guys, caught you at EGX last week, got front row seats during the Saturday Works Venture. Thanks okay. to you all for giving me such happy memories. Well, thanks for coming, Shay. All right. Sorry, Mike. What, what, what have you found? It was better before. There are too many rules to remember. Don't right. go here. Don't touch that. Don't talk to the patients. The doctors are just as scary as the patients. Miss Arthur says orphans shouldn't complain. Orphans shouldn't complain. It's got great handwriting true. for an infant orphan. Yeah, yeah I, think it's, it's a, I think it's a, a font. Pirate. <laughs> uh, yeah, they've done that thing where they stain it with tea and put it in the oven to make yeah. it look all old. Aww. Brent Dreyer says, Hi from Connecticut, guys. Can't stay for long since I'm at work. but just wanted to nominate the Ardat Yakshi Monastery in Mass Effect 3 when we first meet Ooh, the Banshees for scariest. That's a good shout. That, that is a scary was pretty, level. That was pretty creepy. Pretty hair-raising. And another one here from Peter of Astoria who says, Mike, how could you not feature Jeff from Half-Life Alex in this scariest level? Legit terrifying. Let me tell you that I haven't actually got to Jeff yet in Half-Life Alex, but I've been told yeah. it's terrifying. Oh. Oh, what's happening? Oh, what's that sound? I don't know. It sounds bad, doesn't it? it? Sounds bad. I hate it. What is it? It's not radio static. You don't have a radio, do you? Uh, no. Like, seriously, though, what the hell was that? I don't know. Weird noises. But there's a ladder here. There's one that goes up and one that goes down. How are we feeling? Um, oh, ascend. Go where it's less spooky. Mm, you think it gets I less spooky? Yeah, but what if there's? I think I think all the spooks are going to be in the in the actual body in the building of the itself. Asylum. Oh dear. Yeah. Oh no! Well, uh, okay. You're investigating the hag. Where do you think the hag's going to be? Up at the top in the penthouse. Yeah, yeah probably in the, in the hag. It'd be a great penthouse. place to do a jump scare at the top of this ladder as yeah. you're as you're climbing. No game sound, folks. Says say no several game people. sound. Or is it just very? Quiet? It might just be very. It's quiet, very. It wanna. is very it quiet. Is very I could tip it up game. a bit if you like. I could tip mm, it up. I think we should because the soundscape is going to be important here. All right. Is there a is there a, a interaction button where thief just shouts something? Because no, that help. I have a noisemaker out. Yeah, do oh, I mean, it. Fire noise noisemaker out, everyone. Everyone listen for the noisemaker out. I mean, it might to... alert someone, Jane. Oh, that's true. Yeah, but think about the, the precious listeners. All right, fine. Can you, can you hear Mike going through his little oh, yeah, the steampunk clockwork sounds. inventory? Yeah, it's nice, isn't it? Where's can my noisemaker arrow? The clockwork inventory. All right, where should I fire this noisemaker arrow where it's going right to alert the... Hag. the... <laughs> right into the hag's face. I'll fire it back down here because at All least right, that's fine. where we've been. All right, and we everyone know. listen up. Hopefully Making a little low-key firework sound. Yeah. It is a noisemaker. It's quite festive. Yeah. Fred Fry says, sent you guys a package from Germany with some handmade stuff for you all. Oh, Hint, right. they're D&D related a bit. Pray to Cthulhu it arrives safely. Ha ha. Uh, I don't think we've had that yet, have we? No, uh, not that I've seen, no. Okay, we're, we're only going to um, going to our office and studio intermittently. So we'll yeah. check the we'll post next time we're there, Fran. Thank you. Folks, the power's out. Oh, classic. Maybe there's a fuse oh. box in the basement. Thief can, thief can talk, everybody. Yeah, he can. Oh, he's, he's having called Garrett. Oh, he's having problems with ladders. Look at his little oh, legs going. No. This isn't oh, scary. Sound is, <laughs> sound is fine. It's just very, very quiet. It is very quiet. We agree. Says everyone. All okay, right. Good. So good. you can crank it a little, Mike, okay. if you want. Well, I have cranked it slightly, but I don't want to crank it too much because when we get screamed at by a hag, everyone's going to shout at me because their headphones will explode. So, so. we've got to find the everyone fuse, would which like is in it the up, basement. Mike, everyone would like it I've, up. I've put it up. I've put it up. Okay, fine. There's just no sound happening. 
Look at James Hansen has been waiting this? all year for this. What is this climbing? I don't know. What? The ladder thing does not seem to work. Okay, there was like a whispering horror sound. There's a la layer of fog in the basement. There. Yeah. yeah. Is it yeah. fog or is it just flooded? Mm, mm, I don't think it's. Well, maybe it is flooded. I don't know. It doesn't look like water, does it? But then you never this know with old games. Had, this is before we had water technology. Yeah. I can hear some weird moaning net sounds, and I don't like it at all. Can you hear that moaning? That must be in your house. Okay. Yeah. Mm, don't like it. Well, why is why is this place got power? Isn't it like the mid medieval times? No, it's fine. No, oh look, here's the fuse. Here's the fuse. It's burned out. They must have kept a spare fuse somewhere. Hmm, yeah, spare fuse you know, somewhere. Orphanages, very very organised. Mm. Always keep a spare fuse. No, it's steampunk. You've got to have electricity to run your orphanages. In okay. Steampunk times. Well, Rachel Darwin says my son's birthday is on the thirty first, which means. A Halloween birthday. Spooky Congratulations, baby. Congratulations, Rachel. Can I get an early birthday shout out for Leon? Leon's Absolutely, birthday. Absolutely, yeah. 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 Hope you have Happy a birthday, spooky Leon. birthday, Leon. Or if you'd rather people were celebrating your birthday and not Halloween, hope you have a not very spooky birthday. Yeah. A if, completely if, ordinary. If that's not something that annoys birthday. you. <laughs> okay. Okay, that's where we came up. That's the ladder that we struggled to go up and down. What's in here? Oh, I can What's steal that? some oh, candlesticks. Steal, steal everything you can, obviously. That's All the right. point of the game. Ooh. Okay. There's a document. Hmm. Okay. No. Oh, patient histories. Brought in by City Watch, hysterical, carries an urn that contains the ashes of what authorities think might be her own infant. Oh, dear. First to self as Mama Topper. Could prove a dis difficult taste to cure. Dr. Sandbridge. Efforts to take the infant ashes away are always met with the self <laughs> same self destructive behavior. For now, we see no harm allowing subject to carry them with her during a weekly walk to the exercise. Get out of the way, Andy. I can't read this. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Next page, please. Uh, okay. Hold on. My mouse cursor has disappeared. Old is games. This the, is this the hag? No, I don't think so. I okay. think it no, might this, be someone this else. Just ambient. Ambient. Sorry. Page. It wouldn't let me do the next page. What? what? That's important stuff. What? The it's not giving me a mouse cursor, so I can't click it. Does anyone else hear baby crying? I hear backwards baby crying. Oh, dear. Yeah. Backwards baby. Audience, could you just hear the backward baby crying? What are these? Are they health potions and stuff? I don't I like don't this at all. don't like this at all. Is this the cage where they keep the the mama topper? Why is why did, why was the baby crying backwards, though? I don't is know. Some kind of reverse baby? Yeah. I mean, it's a creepy basement. I don't know what you want me to tell you. It's pretty you, creepy. You need to find the fuse so we can get out of this basement, all ideally. Right. Maybe they didn't store the fuse in the basement. Maybe they put it in the cage and then the cage is going to shut behind me and then I'll live here forever. I mean, I can definitely go in here, can't I? The, the, the door's glowing. So it wants me to do it, doesn't it? it wants is it me some to... kind of steampunk elevator? The... Hmm. I mean, or is it just a cage? It's going to shut the you door. Just... Then if Mama Topper comes to get me, I'm fine. I'm People are saying they can only barely hear the spooky sounds. All right, I'll turn them up more. Crank it. But crank don't it blame me when your it's cranked. But don't blame right. me when your headphones explode. Everyone, okay. I want you to sign an imaginary waiver that says Mike is not to blame yeah. if your eardrums explode <laughs> when we get scared. Exploded. Okay, everyone, I want you to write it on your screen now. Yep. Yeah. Press your palm to your screen to sign the waiver. The sounds are getting louder anyway. They're getting more. Okay. Well, we frequent. can adjust if it gets too loud and horrifying. Okay. All right. Hold on. Well, it doesn't I can't see a fuse around here at all? Can you? So, is uh, it? Is things rumbling as well? Is the entire place about to fall in? Is that just your mouse? I don't mouse? know. Jane, you know this level, don't you? Me? No. Oh, okay. All right. Oh, ladders! So my old nemesis. My old nemesis. <laughs> I'm stuck on the ladder again. Hold on. Maybe if Are I you stand. You're just sort of like gently brushing your cheek against the side of it. Yeah, it's weird, isn't it? I do get up eventually, I think. It, it eventually lets me. I could be trapped in this basement forever because of old games. Uh, hold on. <laughs> old games, everybody. Let me see if it helps if I'm in third person. Let me see what's happening. Yeah, here. let's get a look at Garrett. Are you on the wrong side of the ladder? You're on the wrong side of the ladder. Are no, I'm not. Look, no, this the right is the, the ladder. ladder. Yeah. Also, I like that how in video games, ladders have a right side and a wrong side. Whereas in real life, like yeah. ladders are omnidirectional. I've jumped up yes. a bit. 
Now, go oh, up. Oh, no! Garrett! Garrett, you're embarrassing yeah, yourself. Yeah, you really are. Can you turn on no clip and just <laughs> up there? fly up there? Yeah, am I? For those of you asking, what game is this? This is Thief, the original Thief. Yeah. Not the, not the remake, much more recent. This and is not Thief, the Deadly Shadows. Old, old ass broken Thief. Original Thief. Becca C says, finally catching a stream again. Birthday day off from work. Since going back to the office in July. Happy Hello Stream. Happy birthday and happy Hello Stream to you, Becca. It really doesn't nice like to this. Have a day off work. Really doesn't like this ladder at all. Look, I'm, mm. I'm sort. Of, oh, oh, there you go. Wow, the I just had to. Yeah. I just had to yeah, edge si on. sideways into it uh, for it to work. So I guess we need to go up, and maybe yeah, there's a fuse up one. here. Okay. Just edge sideways into it in this in the standard way. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> and then if I go right here, maybe that will be the answer. Okay. There's a face there. Don't like the face. Look at that. It's weird. Yeah, that's creepy. Oh. It's amazing how just some like low quality polygons and some horrible noises are really effective in terms of mm. atmosphere. Ooh, things to rob. That's really unpleasant. Yeah. I don't want to hear that. There's more candlesticks. Oops, I threw a flash Whoa. bomb. Okay. That was me. Don't worry everyone, that was just Mike. Don't worry everyone, that wasn't the I frightened myself. The flash bomb. I frightened myself. <laughs> that was a self <laughs> jump scare. A self We need that we need those flash bombs to kill the ghosts, probably. Yeah, or zombies or whatever will come out. Ghosts and zombies. I've, I've got a feeling it'll be zombies, right? I don't know. There's a chair here. Probably oh, no. a ghost lives on it. Mm. I mean... So, back in the day, like... You know PC Gamer magazine? Yeah. yeah. They wrote a ten-page review. Whoa! What was that? What the hell was that? I don't know. It's creaky. Is that a blanket? It's like a sandbag or something. A cushion. I don't know. Weird. Oh, you can pick it up and throw it around. Good. Yeah. Okay. Um. So that yeah, PC Gamer wrote like a ten-page review of this level. Wow. I didn't want to have my picture painted, but I was too scared to say no. I guess I did it right because he said I sat good and still. Mm. Weird. Creepy. Uh, do you reckon this apple's Perfectly good to eat, imagine. or maybe not? Um. Maybe it's not. Shimmering. <laughs> pick yeah. it up. I don't think apples are supposed to do that. Thank you for no, I don't want to. It's a haunted apple, clearly. Well, I'm glad we haven't met anyone yet. That's good. Because I yeah. don't think I want to meet anyone in this, well, in this horrible level. It? Yeah, but how abandoned, Jane? Are we talking actually abandoned or are we talking horror movie abandoned? There'll are be there some a... property developer turning it into luxury <laughs> condominium flats actually, it's, or something. It's got great bones. Yeah, look at this. Most of them buried like, in the basement. But... Industrial architecture. <laughs> Oh, glowing things. Or iron staircases. Treats. Now, am I going to be punished? For, oh, what's that in the corner? Are you going to be punished? To, oh, is that, that a bag? It's a, it's a bag. It's a bag. Oh, it's not a person. What's making that sound? I don't know. Andy, I don't know. someone banging on a window. I can't see anyone in the windows, so... Shall I grab those things? Do I need them? What do you reckon? Do you reckon I'll be... Oh, definitely a bag on the left. That's my own shadow, which no, just... No, on the left of the health potion. Yeah, yeah, it's a bag. It's a bag. Oh, okay, it's a sack. Right. It's a hessian sack. The game is called Thief Deadly Shadows. The shadow might kill you. All right, what have we got here? I'm not going to take them. I don't want to take them because something might, something might jump out at me. You? Something might jump out me. No, I just don't... You might need them. No, I've got loads of stuff. Look at all the stuff I've got. Look at all this. Might be some sort of ghost antidote. I've got eight health potions. I've got oil right, flasks okay, for days. Okay, potions for days. Yeah, I'm fine. I'm going up to the tower. Whoa! Oh, oh lots of angry. lots of banging and knocking. Banging and clanging. Something's trying to get at you. It really doesn't want me to go up the stairs, does it? Well, and yet you're going up the stairs. Oh, no, well. You're very inconsistent. Hello? Anyone in the attic? Ooh. Mm, I really hate that banging sound. <laughs> it's not good, is it? It's like, now, really... Andy, you said the scariest part of a house was the basement. But what about the attic? There oh, is, my God. Look at that a painting there in the corner. A, there is a painting in the corner. Might go and investigate the painting. All right. Hold on. Hold on. Let me just... What was over <sighs> here? The fuse. The fuse. Ah, the fuse we were after. Of course, we kept it in the attic. Eric Morgan says, Egads, this is too spooky. Take this fiver, foul spirits, and be gone. Thanks, Eric. <laughs> I'm, sure Thanks, I'm sure they'll, I'm sure they'll leave us alone. We're sticking around. Wait, it's... Van Gogh says, hi, hello, happy hello stream and happy birthday to me. Another bloody birthday. Happy it, birthday. It's the child. It's, it's the painting that she sat oh, for. Oh, she sat good she's still for. Familiar. It's that keeper translator girl. But that can't be. This portrait must be as old as the building. Can't be as old as the building if it's in the building. Oh. I can hear you breathing. Nobody here in the cradle does uh -oh. that anymore. Ghost, everybody. Oh, I've activated the ghosts. Something changed 
when you saw oh, my picture. No. You looked at the picture! I didn't mean to! Well, I did sort of mean to. I pressed the F button to interact with it. The cradle won't let any of us go. She's doing that spooky help echo me? talk. Mm. They Will you help me? With my blood. Oh no, why did they do that? Storm cellar. Maybe she was it's donating. dark down there. Please find the bottle and drop it into a drain pipe so it will Please pour my blood into the <laughs> <this laughs> <point. laughs> Only this way can I be free. New objective, don't New get objective, killed by ghosts. pour blood down drain. Burrito says $5, a, a tip for Brave Mike. Thanks. There you go. Thank for you. Your bravery. What's this? Is it a ghost? Oh, it's got the shadow of a little girl. Oh, no. Deadly shadows. It's a no, deadly shadow. It's a deadly shadow. Shall I go towards it and put my face in it? No. I don't, I don't think you have any choice. Wait, let me save the game first. Probably F5 is saved. No, it's not. All right, forget it. <laughs> F5 is closed game. Do not save. Oh, put your it's face got a in face. It. Oh, it's a mask. Is it a mask? Oh, she's ah, moving. Ah, ah, it's moving. She's moving. Oh, that's weird. Uh. Use it with the noisemaker arrow. Oh, <laughs> your own shadow is flashbang it. Flashbang, flashbang out. Oh, oh, what the weird. This is weird. This is weird stuff. She's getting bigger. Don't, Don't turn your back on her. That's how she gets All right, you. So you want me to back out of the room like this? I want you to like bow and scrape. Bow and scrape. Terribly bow sorry for disturbing sorry, sorry, you sorry. in your eternal sorry. slumber or whatever. And leave. And then we're going to go down the basement, put the fuse in the fuse box, uh, get the find blood, a bottle of baby pour blood. it down the storm drain. <laughs> <laughs> and only that way oh. can Laurel know peace. I don't like these. I don't like these objectives that you've oh given me. God. It's not. It's not nice. So oh pleasant. yeah, what was it we were saying about like easing into the scares and the and the stuff? I thought it might ease you into the scares. What to play a non-scary game, Deadly Shadows? Yeah. <laughs> well, shows how much you know, doesn't Lauren it? Lauren Ritchie says, "Hello, stream always ends with me wanting to slingshot my ovaries into the sun. Why so many spooky babies, kids?" We, we were, were discussing this earlier. Yeah. You think it's game developers who are afraid of parenthood? Yeah. Now, to be fair, in Resident Evil Village's case. Yes. That is a vision that Ethan is having, who is a new father whose child may be part mushroom monster. So it's about his anxiety. So I think about it's about his parenthood anxiety because yeah. he's he's a mold man. As projected right. by the game developers. Right. Heat therapy to ameliorate dampness in hyperemotive patients. This sounds innocent. Dampness. Yeah. Sweatiness of the foot. <laughs> I prescribe you with dampness. Patients who have lost foot. touch with reality often have a marked dampness to their extremities, a clamminess of the hand, the sweatiness of the foot. These symptoms result from an excess of emotive humours mm. that are trapped emotive within humors. the individual due to bile This deficiency. doesn't sound like medicine. <laughs> Although <laughs> electrical regimes are often used with this type of patient, I, the great humanitarian Dr. Will Hanscom, <laughs> have had great success with Big the Willy Hanscom. <laughs> Heat must be of the dry variety. As hot water submersion only exacerbates symptoms by, you know, boiling the patient alive. Press, so, can you press right on the? Uh, no, it doesn't, it doesn't go. It doesn't go. It doesn't go. This is before. But I need to know what happens right. next. Oh, oh, the mouse wheel. Yes. The mouse wheel works. Increasing emotive humours. The hot elements must be laid. So you've invented branding, have you? You've invented branding Good work. people with Good hot work, doc. metals or something. It's always bloody branding, isn't it? There's lots more moaning going on and stuff. Well, I've invented steal a new stuff. kind of heat therapy. I feel like stealing this guy's stuff is, is, is totally justified because he's evil. Yeah. So. yeah. He seems like a, a bad... And bad I've, got to hit my, I've got to hit my loot quota. I'm a thief, you know? I've got to make a living. What's this? What's going on here? What's all Ooh. these swirly pipes and things? Oh, it's a furnace. Is the furnace going to come alive and eat me? Mm, doesn't seem like on brand. What if something jumps out? There might be something in it, though. Hello. That's more of a Home Alone, <laughs> home alone thing. Oh. oh, that was you yelling. I got hurt There's by nothing it. supernatural that you climbed into a furnace. <laughs> <laughs> right. Why is it hot, though? It's not a ghost hot. thing. Maybe it's haunting, haunted flames or something. I don't know. Again, that's really no. more of a Home ghost Alone flames. thing than a, yeah. Yeah, than a Shell Bridge Cradle thing. All right. Morgan Fox says, I don't think that man has ever been to medical school. <laughs> and Jason Brown says, hey, y'all. How's it going, Jane? Hope all is well, y'all. Thanks, ah. Jason. All oh, was well till I started playing this. Oh, I've thrown another oil flask <laughs> or something. Stop it. Mike's fear response is yeah, to smash to, something. To smash I know stuff. there are spooky sounds right now. Keep you cool. I can't. But keep you cool. I can't. It's too much. It's too much. This we need to get back down into that basement and oh, find that you're gonna bottle make me, of child's blood. You're going to make me climb yeah. a ladder, are you? Oh, we haven't gone to the lobby yet. What's here? Lobby. <laughs> Let's all go to the lobby. Get ourselves some blood. 
Zulu Bunsen says, you guys are already my favorite YouTube channel, but I love you people even more for making a whole stream from this level. Oh, wow. I mean, if we we'll see how long it, we last, yeah. Yeah. What's this? Just Is this like the drain pipe you've got to drop it down? Shapes no, in be... the darkness. Mm. There'll be a drain pipe somewhere in the basement, I'm sure. I wish it, they would stop making ghost sounds in our ear, though. Yeah. They're horrible noises. Whoever did the, the sound Faith design on this? Horseman says this game is too dark for YouTube compression. There's certainly some compression going on. I can make it brighter a bit if you want. I don't think that will help YouTube. No, probably not. I think YouTube is doing the best it can. <laughs> Bless its heart. Okay. All right, back in the basement. <laughs> hey now. I just took a little peek at the actual stream, and it is uh, it's quite grainy. But then this is what we call a very old video yeah. game. It wouldn't, look, it wouldn't look like good even if it wasn't grainy. Should I just drop yeah. down? Just drop down. Just take drop. the hit. Ah. Oh. oh, Garrett, we're sorry. One life gem. Just one life crystal. Right, all right. What do you think is going to happen when I put the fuse in the old generator? What do you reckon? I think um, all the lights will come on and we'll be able to see where we're going. I mean, nice. less spooky. Oh, Ooh. no. That was, that was a, a, that was a oh, lot of... Oh, you just all right. smashed your ankles. Hold on, let me chug a health potion. There we go. We're all good. We're all healthy. Okay, what kind of... When I get attacked by ghost children, what kind of a ammo do I want? Fire arrow, right? Uh, you want like a proton arrow. Proton. Holy, arrow. holy yeah. water? Holy water, holy water would be good. I do not. I just have regular water. Didn't bring the holy stuff. Do you think... Oh, thanks, thanks, Uncle Brat, who leaves us a lovely tip for this is for popcorn on movie night. That's coming oh, this Friday. Yeah. Thanks. We've been thanks, planning Uncle the Brat. movie watch along night, which is coming this Friday evening, UK we're, time. Yeah, we're, we're watching Plan 9 from Outer Space, which I have never seen. I've never seen it, it either, but it looks like it's really bad. That's the cage where they Ooh. used to put the new patients until a cell opened up. You should stay out of there, or the crater oh. might see you. And try We've to already been in there, Ghost. Yeah, I was in on it. I, it Ghost, we it. already went in there. But let's shut the door anyway, just in case, hey? Yeah, just in case you get tempted to get back in. Is it something glowing up here? No. Oh. Yeah, it's just a bottle. Oh. This one must Is it blood? Be it's, it's still oh, warm. Blood. It's still warm somehow. How is it still warm? Great. I love how like resigned he is. He's like, brilliant. brilliant. Definitely haunted. <laughs> it's Another definitely fine haunted. mess you've got me into. <laughs> Alright, so I got the blood. All we need to do is pour it down a drain pipe, and then we can get out of here, presumably. Quick, find a drain pipe. Follow these pipes. See where they lead. Well, hopefully to the generator, right? That's where I think yeah. I'm going. Mm. Why would the pipes lead to the generator? Pipes carry water. I am going to save the game, okay? Just excuse me for a moment. Yeah, okay. I'm going to use my invisible mouse cursor to oh, save man. the game. Look, this, is what, this is what interface looked like yeah. back in yeah. the day. Look at all that papyrus font. What if, what if the hag comes out, though? Well, then I'll reload. I'll reload. Um... I'm apparently only in the outer cradle. Yeah, you, oh, you're not no. actually in the place yet. In what? A... Oh, dear. In a cradle. In a cradle. Right, okay. okay. Right, pop that All fuse right. in. Yeah, slam dunk the fuse. The power. There we go, we've got some light. Oh, that helps. The power. Now we can see. I mean, the, it doesn't sound happy. Oh. But maybe that's just what old boilers sound like, right? Lots of clanking and moaning. Yeah. The occasional backwards baby crying. That's just an old boiler yeah, yeah. waking up. You gotta expect that in a little <laughs> yeah. house like this. Yeah, exactly. Back, baby, backwards baby crying. Stephen Blalock says, um, "Morning all, happy Alice stream. Just watched Ellen's Dead Space playthrough, followed by watching the brain slash head that couldn't wouldn't die, <laughs> couldn't slash wouldn't which die. is the movie we watched last year mm. um, that couldn't quite that settle couldn't on its die. own title." Yeah. Um, yeah. So I think the drain pipe was in the lobby, right? We saw it already. Yeah, Maybe. it was like either side of the lobby. I think. Yeah. Come uh, on, yeah, Garrett. So Come movie on, night's buddy. happening Friday. Wednesday, we're playing a brand new uh, Jackbox party game, which is sort of uh, suitably spooky. It's about a murder mystery party. Mm -hmm. Thursday, Ellen's playing uh, Layers of Fear, I believe, over on yep. Oxtra. On the old Fear Academy. On the old Fear Academy. Can you just get the angle right on this ladder. We'll get there in, the... well, <laughs> in a moment. <laughs> well, Mike cops his way up this ladder. <laughs> um, what else is happening? Tomorrow, Andy's back playing Resident Evil HD. Yeah. I'll be continuing past through the, the residence. Yeah. I reckon. I'm yeah. at the residence. I'm at the residence evil. Found an evil. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. You're not quite crouched or anything, are you? I mean, I was crouched, but it doesn't make any difference, really. Let okay. me just. And then we've got even but... more good stuff coming up next week, including Halloween Ox Adventure Special. We've got more oh, good yeah. stuff coming up today. We're going to be doing an <gasps> FMV zone. Right That's after. right. Yes. Over on Oxtra. We're taking over all the airwaves. We control the vertical and we control the horizontal. We <laughs> will be following up this. We control the vertical at the moment. Xbox. I can't get up this bloody ladder. 
Over on Outside Extra, we are going to be playing a modern FMV game called At Dead of Night. Um, oh, He's look having at a great you. time. He's look having a great time. to get up that ladder. And uh, yeah, Luke's not feeling terribly well, so we are going to be taking over bravely. Yeah. It's Luke, playing it's, an FMV game. It's Luke's FMV zone without Luke, but that's it's fine. Andy and Luke's FMV zone without Luke, without but, Luke. With but with Jane and Mike. Yes. Yeah. And I was having a look at Out Dead of Night and it looks really, really good. It's like a ghost hunting live action movie that's interactive. Mm. You know what FMVs are. I mean, I assume. Yeah. Come on. I just want to get up this ladder and I'm cool. never coming it. down to Are this... you trying to lick it? I, I'm going sideways into it. All right, hold on. Can you Getting a lot of advice it, in the like chat. A snake. Can you kind of go like in one and then out the other <laughs> and in one and just like <laughs> is, snake your way? Is the advice? Oh, there we go. I've got. I'm just going to strafe along it until I, I hit the sweet spot. Yeah. Yeah. Is the advice from the chat play a more modern game that doesn't have problems yeah. with ladders? Yeah, it might be. Um, right, dump this blood in the drains so that everyone can enjoy some blood in their drinking water. Yeah. Got it. Wolf's brain says awake early enough to catch a stream for the first time in ages. Hooray for night shift jobs. Super happy the weather's getting cold enough for my safety beanie. Yay! Good old safety beanie. I should dig mine out. It's actually kind of a little bit warm in here right now for a beanie, but maybe later. Uh, are our Hello, Hello Stream t-shirts on sale? Our so, Hello Stream t-shirts are on sale. If you go to store.outsidexbox.com, <laughs> there Not are... Not at all loaded question, yeah. <laughs> yeah. There are extremely good t-shirts, tote bags, and posters with this year's Hello Stream illustration, which you probably saw retro. at the start of this. Oh, no, yeah, Andy's wearing last year's. That's not a but good uh, we'll show you the new ones soon. So yeah. thi this must we forgot be... to order ones for ourselves. So they are. Yeah, <laughs> they're on the way. <laughs> yeah. So this must be the the inner cradle must be through here. But I need to get the old lock need to... the lockdown portcullis open before I. Yeah. Can... Well, get dump the blood in the drain. Otherwise, yeah. it's going right. to give I'm... me anxiety that you're not doing it. All right, I'm good. I'm trying, I'm trying. But I'm sneaking everywhere. Don't make me not sneak everywhere because it's too creepy. A ghost's you. fooled by stealth. Yeah, I feel if like you're good enough. The cradle has seen you. Is like the cradle knows you. The there. cradle must. I'm all up in the cradle, aren't I? So it must know. <laughs> you're in the outer cradle. You're not all up in the inner cradle. No, but it's, I'm all up in the outer cradle's business, definitely. Cheerful spider in the chat asks Andy, "How does this level compare to the Resident Evil lab you used to work in?" Now that's going to need some context for people who don't know the story, Andy. Oh yeah, um, I had a temping job after I left university. Uh, Making processing invoices for a biotech research company that was based in a uh, an old manor house mm. in Cambridge. The place is called um, Babram Hall. It's like an old uh, manor house, and there's like a biotech campus that sort of sprung up around it now. But um, parts of it are still based in the old mansion. Which uh, was it this spooky? is this is no, it was Not, more like no. a it's quite pleasant modern workplace. Okay. Yeah, unfortunately. Mm. But uh, this is a lot spookier, I will say. Was that fog there before? I don't know. Was this, this fog always was this here? room here before? Oh, it's the beds. It's the beds where all the all the people uh, live. So this is the dormitory. Oh, look, so you haven't gone back to the lobby to drop the blood off then? No, well, I just thought I'd stick my head round round the door, see what's going on in here. Please drop the blood off. I'll try. Otherwise, we'll forget. Stew. I found a real good Holy hiding place for the bag of gold out. teeth. <laughs> It's real hard to find, and anyway, it's the morgue, and ain't nobody goes in there unless they have to, or they's dead. Do you know what I mean? I figure a couple more days, a week tops, I'll have yanked enough gold teeth from these poor dead loonies to buy <laughs> something real fancy. You have to do your part, which is to find us a buyer, the kind that don't ask too many questions <laughs> like, about the gold What's this bag teeth. of teeth? Where did this bag of teeth come I from? I mean, you can't just walk into any old place and sell a bag of gold teeth. <laughs> yeah. Don't let me down, Desmond. Desmond. I'm not sure you right, thought so this through, Desmond. If we go to the morgue, we can have the bag of gold teeth. Sweet. All right, I'm going to take these health potions because I did have to yeah. use two when I fell down a ruddy ladder. If I was going to haunt anything and I were a ghost, I would probably this haunt room? the gold teeth that were stolen oh, right yeah. out of my head. Yeah. Unfinished business, which is having teeth. If you had to haunt something, Andy, what would you haunt after um, your passing, your tragic passing? The Disneyland Haunted Mansion. Okay. You want us to scatter your ashes there? They Apparently, they have a real problem with people scattering ashes there. <laughs> so, That's amazing. Bad news, isn't it? Yeah. All right. So, what do you need to get this open? It's frowned upon. I don't know. Maybe a lockpick, but... Yeah. I'm having well, you're not allowed to scatter ashes just everywhere, are you? I think you have to I get mean, like, it's, a yeah, it's, it's like a biohazard. Ooh. <laughs> Pretty sure. Yeah. Right, I don't know I if I should really. Thieving. I don't know if I should be robbing all these old people, uh, these old dead people. I mean, I mean it's, a they're, it's they're an dead. evil corrupt asylum, right? Yeah, but this is the belongings of the uh, of the patients. That sounds like a good click. Yeah, it's a good click. If I know anything about lockpicking. 
Shay Gray says, word to the wise, my friend is a connoisseur of horror games, but had to stop her at Dead of Night stream halfway through because she was so scared. Oh, no. Oh, dear. No. Oh, that's what we're playing next. Yeah. We're going to take a short break after this stream, and then mm. we're going to hop on over to Outside Extra, and we're going to play at Dead of Night, which is a modern live-action horror movie interactive. Will I be able to game. climb up ladders in that game? Yes. Okay, good. There will Asha be Payne. all ladder climbing all the time. Asha Payne says, hey, crew, mind making more mugs? Obsessed. Two, if you could have brunch with any scary movie villain slash monster, who would it be? The tall man Ooh. from Phantasm. Who? The tall man from Phantasm. Oh, okay. Oh, a tiara? Yeah, it's like a tiara. Yeah. Wow. Probably haunted. Ghost, a ghost Most, tiara. like, slasher movie villains. They're not going to be a great brunch company. Not a great conversation, are they, really? What about Hannibal? Does Hannibal count? Oh, Hannibal He's, would be amazing. He slashes things. Yeah, 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 yeah but for sure. maybe go somewhere else for brunch. Other than his house. Yeah, you know, sometimes <laughs> you want to, um, you just want pancakes. And you'd be like, oh, these are tiny birds you eat live and you have to put a towel <laughs> over your head so God can't see you. And you're like, I just want some, just want some pancakes, Hannibal. Yeah. Or, like, um, oh, I don't know. Exquisite. Did we say movie monsters? Was that the, was that the uh, criteria? Scary movie villain slash monster. Uh, Lestat. Let's go with Lestat. Yeah. Just yeah. Sophisticated gentleman. You'd have to have like blood sausage. Yeah. It'd be all, all blood. Did you Where throw that, le that le lever now? Uh, I haven't thrown the lever yet because I was looking for the lobby. Oh, okay. It was this oh, way, yeah. wasn't it? It was this way. For the blood. For the pull blood, the blood yeah. I assume you, those are the drains that you pull them down. I'm pretty sure, yeah. They look like... Eleanor Smith says, watching through the stream to get away from my spooky unopened emails. The spooky thing is that there's over 3,000 of them. Nice. Nice <laughs> What's something work. you've let get out of hand? <laughs> <laughs> well, my unread email, yes. Yeah. My unread emails was way more than 3,000. With a cradle um, can't see it. I have to get rid of all my things. Oh. Uh, the cradle uses them to remember me. That's how uh, it I can help you get rid of stuff by stealing it. I'm a thief. We're going to steal all Laurel's things and then the cradle King will forget about White her. Hall, where they kept a very bad patient. One of them took my nightgown back to his cell. It's still there. Oh, Please dear. Please get my nightgown and then burn it up. Oh, that's in where the, the gold more. teeth are. We were heading there anyway to steal some gold teeth. Yeah. So that's on our that's on our to-do list. Great. Well, you know um, what? Yeah, I'm... my my unread emails was way over that um, because we get so many press releases that I just don't read. Mm. What you want to do is go select all, Dilly. mark all as read. Yeah. Problem solved. <laughs> With no consequences. Zero or inbox. Oh, look, there's oh, fire the in the furnace on. now. So now that explains why nice. I would be burning in it. I, just oh, yeah, I stop... reckon the game is programmed to burn you regardless. If, yeah. Because... yeah. Why not? I just sort of stopped seeing the numbers some, like after a while, but people occasionally see my iPhone home screen and they're like, how do you live like What this? is wrong yeah, with you? Yeah. I, I, I was sitting yeah. on a train with Bendix and um, and uh, she was horrified, basically, yeah, of, uh, about the number of unread emails. But then I got an Android phone and it's less annoying. It doesn't bother you. It gets, it gets beyond a certain point and it just doesn't bother showing you anymore because it knows. Right. So, like, You're you going to throw that lever, care. right? Yep. It's up here, right? I think. Yeah, so I think it was the other way through that door, uh, that it? archway, down, 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 down the here. stairs. Okay. The other way that wasn't to the lobby. Yeah, through here, on the right. Oh yeah. yeah. Good. I. This all looks the same to me. It's all the same. Okay, just oh. polygons. Just a quick PSA from Monster Noodle, who says, "Don't scatter ashes at theme parks, folks. Some poor worker will have to sweep them up and throw them away. Bad times for everyone, to be honest. That is fair. That is yeah. extremely And also, fair. if like and you're breathing, you don't want to be breathing in someone's memo." Ashes? No. <laughs> yeah. uh, so. Oh, there's a vortex. Or a I, ah! I flash bombed again. Sorry. Mike, stop <laughs> setting off flash bombs in the haunted asylum. <laughs> the true jump scare is Mike himself. Uh, Shall I go it. through the weird vortex or what? Yeah, go through the vortex. What do you reckon? I mean, YOLO. What could go wrong. Yeah, yeah, YOLO. What's that say? Exercise yard. Mm. YOLO is you only. You, you know, YOVO is you only vortex once. Yeah. That feels like but that feels like actually like less of a creepy thing and more just like a level transition. Do you know what I mean? Mm. So I think well, maybe, transition. No, let's poke around this bit just a little bit longer. Like this bit's up here. What about okay, this? Okay, fine. Staff tower. See, they've got their own tower. All right. That's the staff tower. Nobody's uh, up there. Call me no uh, Call me nobody then cuz I'm going up. But there's no staff here. Go, go scale. We're staff now. Sean Carr says, hey, Andy, have you ever considered making a playlist of your section headers from Morgan Mondays? My wife and I are playing together and thought it'd be fun to have your expert showmanship, too. Oh, I did. I did suggest it, um, but everyone 
thought that no one would want to watch it, so I haven't. But oh, if you, you mean think your little playlist? Uh, a playlist my little, the my little intros, parts. yeah, I thought we could put them up as shorts, maybe. Let's do it. Um, yeah, let's do yeah, it. Yeah, we can put them up as okay. shorts. Right. Ninja Ninja says, condolences, Mike, just read your relative was fired as official wizard of Christchurch, New Zealand. I'm sure the channel Bloodline is devastated. Yes. Yeah, we're, everyone, we're... if you heard about the wizard of Christchurch, New Zealand, that is a blood relative of Mr. <laughs> yeah. Mike channel here. Some distant. All right, are we going in the inner cradle? Yeah, inner cradle, let's go. Right, well, let me just wave my invisible mouse cursor around until I get so what, to what did, what What's it about not angering a wizard? Didn't Tolkien say, don't, don't make wizards angry. No, I think he said, like, wind Mate. up wizards all you want. Yeah. <laughs> they can't actually do anything magic's not real, I think oh. is what he said. So there won't be uh, a, a terrible vengeance being wrought on Christchurch, New Zealand by the yeah. wizard. Oh, no! It's my desktop. Oh, no, no everyone, Mike, your the desktop. true horror. The, the true, true horror, horror of Mike's, Mike's desktop. desktop. <laughs> his, Don't look at it. His car wallpapers. <laughs> Don't look at all his documents. It's fine. Uh, right. Okay. Well, we're in Something the... If you have a car wallpaper. What, what are you, I, what, what's your you wallpaper? Not, Andy? Can you not believe that? My Could you not predict it? The fern pattern from Windows ninety five. <laughs> it certainly isn't. Uh, right, okay. In a cradle. There's a document on that bed behind you. Document. No, it's just a, it's just a sort of. Shadow. Oh, it's just a sorry, a, it's a rectangle. It, of light. I did. I thought the same thing, but it just turns but out. What textures are, bad. are this lo low resolution? Yeah. Yeah. Anything can be anything. Yeah. Did, did this it also is... save when you came in? Because if not, you should save. Oh yeah, that's a pretty good idea. Gets you. Anyway, pour one out for the Wizard of New Zealand, everybody. Yeah. He'll Make keep doing cool. his thing. He said, I'll keep doing it until I'm dead. So I guess he's still going to be there. He also described it as being cancelled, which I thought was a little... Oh! Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Weird. What, have they They've, made the, uh, the position no longer... Like, it no longer exists, the role it's itself. Not, it's not... Well, I don't know. It's just that he... they're trying to move away from the image of New Zealand <laughs> as being a sort of whimsical <laughs> land. Hobbit <of> land. <laughs> Okay, um, they were paying him eight thousand pounds, eight thousand English pounds um, equi good. equivalent per year to, to do active wizardry, bad. and then they've decided oh, they don't want to do that. And he said he's going to carry on working. So maybe they were idiots for paying him in the first place because it sounds like he would uh, do, do it for free. <laughs> I would do it for free. Move to New Zealand, be a wizard. Yes, please. Well, I assume you know I, all I have to do is fly to New Zealand to um, accept my birthright and become a wizard as well. I, I assumed you had to fight him. For yeah. The, okay. Know, Wrestle the over, over the over the staff. What's and if this, you win, what's this ticking? You get to be wizard. Ticking. I can hear a ticking as well. Oh, it could be like footsteps or something, couldn't it? No, no it's literally it's ticking. a ticking clock. Did Mike set off one of his clockwork smoke bombs or something? Maybe. <laughs> There's a lot uh, of mechanical ticking and whirring happening. Okay. Yeah, probably some kind of sentry bot. Some sort of mechanical droid. What do we think? How are we feeling? Lots of flashing um, lights. I mean, bad. Suggests a haunting. Oh, something moved over there. I saw a shadow what? move. I saw a shadow move. I saw a shadow Seems move. It's kind of paranormal up here. I'm not, I'm not going to lie. Would you say there's paranormal activity? I would say there's a lot of paranormal zoo. activity. There was That's a... the latest. Am latest I going to stick my head around this corner paranormal and see activity. what that shadow was? Yeah. Follow the shadow. You think I should follow the shadow? That's what it was. <laughs> Who are we to deny thief? Mm. I hear breathing, I hear, and it's not mine, and it's not yours. Oh, I accidentally pressed the button that would, like, pick a lock, and I don't want to do that, because it's okay, no. take about five Dr. minutes. Dr. Shkaf says, you guys help me to relax as I made Oh, it's a zombie! Oh, it's Whoa. a zombie! Oh, no! I didn't see it! Oh, ah, no, it's a ah, zombie! Ah, ah, ah. Close, the, close the gate, close the gate. Shoot it! Shoot it with an arrow! Is it going to... Uh, well, I could do, couldn't I? It's just a zombie, it's just one it? zombie. How bad could it be? Get, let me get a what, look does at that, it. what does that plaque say? Does it say who the zombie is? Meal hall. Meal hall. Oh. But if there's one zombie, there might be more zombies, James. Oh, it's like ants. There's one ant. There's a million ants. Wait, where did he go? Did he come around? He is went he... that way. I think there's just an open door. Is there an open way. door this way? <laughs> yeah. Oh, no. Maybe no, not. no, we're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. Well, we've encountered our first baddie. One oh, he can open doors. He can open doors. Oh, no. He can open doors. He's loose. Should I try and there's set fire girl. to him with a fire arrow? Yeah, oh. set him on fire with a fire arrow. Okay. Just a warning to anyone who has uh, photosensitivity. There's going to be a lot of flickering. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Where, where did he go? Where did he go? He's right behind you. He's outsmarted you. Oh, he's running towards oh, me. Oh, no, he you. didn't. Oh, he oh, wasn't oh, even bothered. Oh, no, he's got a... He was friendly. He right. was friendly, zombie. He bloody was. He's on fire. He's got a, a reverse bear trap hat on. Oh, I think he was... Whoa. On your side. Whoa, whoa, another zombie. Oh, oh, <laughs> No, oh, so tall. I've got so little health now. Oh no, health potion quick. Okay. Whoa. 
Yeah, they've got some sort of like head apparatus on, haven't they? Yeah. Well, Whoa. ladies and gents, I'm out of fire arrows, so I don't know what okay. to tell you. That was nice I've lasted. got a moss arrow, if that would help. As long as you encounter no more zombies, <laughs> we'll be A-OK. -okay. Sorry about that. Uh, Dr. Shkaf says, um, uh, thanks for helping me relax as I made my way through uni for the second this time. This isn't relaxing. To change careers. Here's a small part from my second paycheck. As a thanks, I'm off to bed. We'll watch this tomorrow. Love the podcast. Okay. Thanks, Dr. Shkaf. And well done on your, on your career transition. Yeah. Well That's done. very bold of you. Well, well done. All of you to watch this to relax. I'd yeah, say. exactly. Mm. Not relaxing at all. Luke T. Simmons says he only wanted a hug. <laughs> Maybe. Count Kane says, "What the heck?" <laughs> My thoughts exactly. All right, save now, Mike, because yeah. Save okay. yourself. Is there a quick save? Save yourself. Uh, I'm not sure. It's fine. Oh, it doesn't take that long. It's fine. Well, it takes quite a while, but that's because it's an old game. Ah. There are lots of bad noises happening. The bad noises are happening. Okay, try this door. No, I don't want to. They're all locked, so I don't want to. But um, pick them, and then you, we've got to go through some of these doors at some point. I think yeah. they're all just cells, just aren't they? Around the corridors forever. Yeah, we can. We can just live here. We need to get out. We need to find this hag. But there are so many, so many locked cells. Ross Wardrop is from New Zealand, saying, Watching from New Zealand myself, also known as the wonderful Hobbit land where wizards regularly run for office. Sounds mm. idyllic over there. Right. Okay. That door's got a window. Should it's a got a light in it. See that? Yeah. I'll try lock I'll try lock picking yeah. this one if it will let me. Do it. Do let me pick. let me lock it. Yeah, there we go. Okay. Oh, that's loud. House doesn't like that. Frost Raven right. says, I always look forward to your hello streams. You lot are the best because then I don't have to play the scary games. I get to watch you do so. That's a service we provide. Yeah, You'll play of the course. scary games so you don't have to. Some people just don't even watch the video. They just have the audio on um, and, and listen to it instead so they don't have to look at the horrible games. Um, God, these locks are so difficult to pick. Yeah. As people who play video games, I think we all understand that lock picking is very easy. Yeah. yeah. You just jam things in it and wiggle it around it until, it, until, until yeah. it pops open like this. Until it makes the right kind of vibration. This has so many concentric circles, this one. Oh, it's, a, it's a tough lock. It's a hard lock. Mm. Welcome to the channel, new member, Kung Fu Panda. Oh, wow, Yay. I'm a big fan. Hollywood royalty. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, last one. Just be unlocked for pity's sake. Cletty Rett says the game is Thief, which I assume means someone was asking what the game is. Maybe I should change the title of this video so people who are like rocking up will know what the game is. Yeah? No. Keep it mysterious. Oh, I unlocked that door and it immediately took me to an area that was already unlocked. What? Uh, well, now you've got a quick escape route if more zombies come at you. That's true. But I have killed both the zombies. So Yeah, all two of the zombies, I don't, presumably. Were they, they were just patients, I think. No, sure this, place has, this place has been abandoned This place has been abandoned for years, probably. Yeah. And the patient's a bit of a Oh, What's that's that? that's something eating something. Shall I well, shoot an arrow in its butt? I don't know. Maybe you should leave it be. No. Look. It's, oh. oh. All right. Yeah, you better get it. Something. Yeah, you better get it. Oh, good didn't, job. It didn't good notice. Job <laughs> good job, arrow drop. You've got to adjust for the Coriolis effect, mate. Oh, it's cross now. Yeah, it's cross. Oh, it's even crosser now. Oh, it's, it's ages till it like... reaches. That's absolutely ages. <laughs> <laughs> Keep going. He's giving up. Oh, he's giving Yeah, he's giving up. Oh, okay. He's running away. Oh, hissing. Uh, Maybe that's the air escaping. Yeah. Oh, yeah, oh I don't that like was, that. No. I do not enjoy that animation. Oh, I was trying to cancel that arrow. Right. Once I saw oh, he's awake again! Ah, ah he got up again! <laughs> No! 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 Shut, shut up, ghost girl! This, this is not the time! I think you ah. need help. Use your dagger! Oh, he punched me to oh. death! No. Laurel's like, let me explain more of the lore of me. Whoa! Whoa. Okay. Welcome back to dry land, Razgriz. 148. Yeah, these are the horrors that await you on dry land. Yeah. Mini Mucha says, do you think Alan Wake is scary? Hmm. It's more atmospheric than it scary. It has its yeah. scary moments. Oh, actually, there's some intense bits of combat that get quite quite hairy and, and hectic but um right so what was the mistake i made there folks not you double got, tapping you got murdered by a zombie yeah 
Do you have a knife? Can you? <laughs> Just I've got a dagger, but it's not a kind of like you don't get insta stealth kills like you do. And... No, no, no. But but when he's down, double tap. I see what you mean. I mean stab, stab. Alan Wake, not very scary, but I do enjoy it. It's more atmospheric than. Yeah, exactly. Scary. Corny. It is quite corny. What? It's quite corny. I thought you said something else, and I was like, I did not <laughs> know you felt that way about Alan Wake. Yeah. Well, I mean, what's not to like? The hoodie, mm. the tweed jacket. <laughs> right. So, uh. You can just go around now. Shall I make sure these guys are dead? No, they're dead. Are you sure? I mean, you can poke them with the dagger. I might do. If you want. Little pokey poke. Look, it's moving. This is my standard Resident Evil tactic. Do you have to burn them? Like in Resident Evil? No. I don't know. I bet you do. Anyway, it's fine. They seem to be dead. They would have woken up. Because yeah. in a game of this era, if a thing was dead, it would probably like dissolve. Do you know what I mean? Ah, uh, no, they've kept but this the is. Corpses there. But this is a, a game oh, about Steve, like yeah, moving you'd, moving you'd bodies move around. Move the corpse stuff. out of. Yeah. yeah, you're right. You're right. Corpse persistence is necessary in a stealth game. Like. Right. Is this where we were before? Where we where we got into trouble? I think. Yeah. That thing standing up and killing us, I think, was scarier than anything that happened in the entirety of last year's Halo stream. <laughs> Probably. Yeah. <laughs> Probably. Already. Such scares. I don't know if you've traumatically repressed the other scares, Andy, because some scary stuff happened last year as well. Okay. How about I just ignore that guy, like he doesn't exist? Or you could just keep putting arrows in him until you're sure he's down. Surely he's guarding something good. Yeah. Oh no, there's another one. Is there? Oh, yeah, yeah, down the end of the corridor. Oh, he's vibrating. Now I can't oh, tell whether that's bad. Oh. No, he's doing no, like a spooky he's seen you. He's seen you. He's coming. He's seen you with his no eyes. I'm running save away. The game. Save the game. Save the game. I'm running away. Run. Uh, save the game, though. Do save the game. I will try in a minute when I'm not running away. Okay, fine. fine. Where are we running to? Are we running right into the arms of zombie number two? I'm not sure. There's not a lot of... You know, with all the lights on, there's not a lot of places to hide, actually, which is a no. bit a bit of a problem. No. I don't like them. I don't like these save the game, though. bad zombies. Well, I haven't made any progress, really. Yeah, but... Other than waking that zombie up. <laughs> oh, I wish I had more fire arrows. That's what I need. It's a bit Friday the 13th, isn't it? Yeah, a little bit. Right. Now, where was I? What's the most powerful weapon I've got? With, are they affected by gas arrows? I don't know. You wouldn't think, if they're not breathing, you wouldn't... Moss arrows, what do they do? They just for... make your... Dampening your footsteps. footsteps. Quiet. So, oh, okay. guess that's might not going to help us. That's not going to do us any good. Jason Hubbub says, "Can you do a stream of Shin Megami Tensei Five, pretty please?" The flowing blue hair demands it. What is? Well, I'll never say never. Shin Megami. It's it's too late to be getting into Shin Megami Tensei if you're not already into it. I think. Okay. Surely. Really? I think if we that started playing Shin Megami Tensei, we'd be like, I have no idea what is going on. Well. Well, maybe five is the one to get started on. Maybe five is where the perfect entry point. Maybe. Maybe. It seems unlikely. All right, now what's the plan, Mike? Should I fire a gas bomb? Right, I will save it here. Okay. okay. Yeah. Just to be sure, I will save. Save, please. And I will... <sighs> then I will fire a gas arrow at this guy and see what happens, okay? All right. Get a snoot full of this gas bomb. Height, higher, higher. Yeah, I got the height. Okay. I got the height. <laughs> Bam! How does he Get like a snoot that? Get He's fine with it. He's bothered. He seems I don't like think he, he breathes. He quite enjoyed the snoot fall. All right. Well, just keep hitting. I mean, you got him before. Just keep hitting with arrows. And then when he's down. We'll stab. Stab, stab, give stab. Him, give him a couple more in the head. Okay. Yeah. Okay. He's cross. He's very yeah. cross. You got him twice. Three, Three times in the knee. Four. Again in the knee. Four. Five. And in the chest. Five. Six. Six in the chest. And Seven. over his shoulder. I don't think that hit. Eight. Yes, that okay. hit. All right. Did it? Okay. All right. Seven or eight. Now go stab him. Stab his body. He doesn't seem to be reacting though. Like. <laughs> no! <laughs> oh God! You he went ah! You absolute clown! I'm stabbing him with the crotch until he falls over. Okay. <laughs> Please. He's getting you though. Please fall over. Okay. <laughs> right, okay. and I'll have a little health potion. Just okay. Treat myself. I feel oh like God. they're scripted to like. Be dead and then get back up at yeah. you as a jump. Oh scene. my god, that's ah! not fair! No! That's not fair! Why? Why? Oh. Does the plaque say Dave the Undying? <laughs> or something? The Look, treatment would room, you... a wet wrap and shock therapy. There we go. Once I saw 
All right. All right. Now, Laurel. Now you can tell us. There's just a head on this chair. Shall I save again? <laughs> yeah, yeah, that was harrowing. I don't want to go through it that. It was horrible, wasn't it? Oh. What is wrong with this game? That was horrible. Hoppa Duffer says, a stream on my birthday. You shouldn't have a perfect way to relax after celebrating a weekend. We've been watching seven years. Here's to many more. Uh, congratulations, Hoppa Duffer. Happy birthday. Yeah, yeah well happy done. Happy birthday. And also Lots two streams. October birthdays. Two streams, yeah. There's we'll another streaming bloody one an FMV there. game. Yeah. Yeah. At Dead of Nights. So I put this mask on, maybe they won't be able to see me. very scary. Uh, well, I that's think that's the electrocution mask or there. something. Is it for the shock treatment? No, this it, isn't. Yes, mm. it must be. Mm. Hmm. Well, there's another guy down this corridor, so. All right, we'll just give him the old eight arrows to <laughs> and many stabs treatment. I read. I read a book about the bad old days where there were exceptionally bad treatments mm. for mental illness yes and they did really like put you in tubs and wrap you in things and like constrict your movement and, and they're like this will help um and yeah. uh i don't think it I did no i yeah. don't think so and people were like why did you think this would help and like, hmm? like well i don't know it sounds like it should horrible 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 this guy better not get up he's he's making his way downtown yeah <laughs> walking fast i'm watching you you jerk i'm watching you homebound Look how much I'm watching him. I'm glad you can see, Mike, because I can barely see on my screen. And I think the people on YouTube can probably see even less. So you're going to have to take our word that there is a monster right there. He's going to jump back up again, I can tell. He's going to jump back up. Okay. Hey. There he is. He did it. He did it. You. Oh, you jerk. So sneaky. How tall do you reckon? Well, Mike's crouching. Yeah. Oh, okay. Right. Okay, Good. I'm just going to move now. I'm just going to get out of here. until You've only got four arrows left. Well, that's a problem, like Andy. Crouch made me think the zombies were like 15 foot tall. You've porcupined two of these <laughs> fellas. Andy, you give me problems oh. and not solutions mm. at the moment. Yeah, that's us. We're the, the problem givers. <laughs> yeah, problem givers. That's what Jane and I call ourselves. Yeah. <laughs> right. I don't even know what I'm supposed to be doing here, really. No, same. Everyone, can we have a like spike for Mike spiking that guy with arrows? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. The mic um, like spike for spiking yeah. thing. Yeah, if you could all hit the like button, I'd appreciate it. We'd appreciate it all. Right. What? Am I back in the ruddy lobby now? It's like Dark Souls, oh, Mike. Oh, God, no. It all connects. Oh, yeah, but I like Dark Souls. Oh, no, he's moving. He's on the move. <laughs> he's Oscar Mike to your location. Yeah, he is, he is. What's this? It's an elevator. Oh, dear. Oh, if I press the button, they're going to hear me, aren't they? Sod it. Let's go. YOLO! Is gonna, something going to come up in the elevator? That might oh. also be a problem. I can hear hissing and stuff. I can hear you breathing. I don't like it. I've stopped breathing. Okay. Right. Well, folks, let me steal this candlestick and think about what I'm going to do. Telesanti Santi says, Mike, please check your inventory for explosives. Also, Mike, you're searching for something. The ghost told you what. It's in a cell. Oh, it was so the... We're searching was the, it's the... It was the robe, wasn't it's it? It's the, the night the gown. That's, gown. that's the side mission. That's not the main mission. Right? Is it? I don't know. I, well, we've yeah. got multiple objectives because we also want to go to the morgue. Oh, the morgue, right? The morgue is where yeah, we're going to yeah. burn it in the morgue because that's where you burn so things. So the nightgown. I've got to steal 40% loot and find a special loot item. Not priorities here, but mainly about find the, the hag. hag. Yeah. Find the nightgown. Find the gold teeth. Oh, find, find this guy. Oh, hello. Okay, I think you're going to have to go stealth. Oh, you. that's the scariest thing you've said all day. So. Willie Mimoth says, this is thief, Mike. Don't stand in the light. I'm trying not to. Oh, look at him vibrating. Oh, he's juddering. He's juddering. That is extremely creepy. It's horrible, isn't it? You seen um, House on Haunted Hill? Mm hmm. The way the, the doctor monster kind of rubbers around in that. It's very spooky. Like, like he's missing several frames of animation. Yes, there's something about. There's something spooky about missing frames of animation. <laughs> Thing is, with an old game, you're never sure whether it's just because it's a bad old game. Okay. Oh, Im Immaculata says finding the nightgown, nightgown is the main quest. Oh, uh -huh. you're kidding me. So I have to unlock all these bloody cells, do I? It's in one of these cells, yeah. 
How am I supposed to do this with these guys wandering around? Hey? Did you see his little hand cages? Yeah. yeah. They put his, his hands that, in little cages. Doesn't help when I'm claw when he's clawing me, does it? No. Right. Well, what's in here? More cells and stuff. Yep. Cells within cells. Yeah. That's a good point, Mike. Ostensibly, the little hand cages are so they can't like get grab you with at you. Their yeah. Hands. But I, I suppose they're and haunted yet, or whatever, aren't they? He's probably just bashing you with his hand cages. Mm, I don't All like right, this very much. Look. I'm gonna have a look for you, Mike. Thank Where you. It is. All right, let me. Laurel's nightgown is in cell number five. It says. <laughs> Ross Wardrop says, there are probably law reasons, but the creatures walking up to a lamp and dancing for a few seconds before walking <laughs> off is hilarious. <laughs> hilarious for you? It's not hilarious for me. What about this? Is this where it is? Uh, maybe. Is that cell number five? No, it doesn't have a number on it. Cell door number five. Do, 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 do. <laughs> I can't see anything in there. It doesn't really look like a cell, does it? It just looks okay, like another locked no. door, so... All right, I'll try and find the. I'll try and find cell number five. I'll try not to get yep. got by a baddie. Is oh. this yep, yep. the cell? The cell block. I mean, these are all cells, aren't they? Aren't they? They don't look like cells. Oh, okay. The, the cells. Oh. oh. No, I'm just going to stand behind this door. Stay out of sight. Stay out of sight. Let him do his little jig, his little dance at the lamp. Recharging. He's moving. Is he moving towards me? Is the question. Phantom Eyebrow says elaborate Victorian knuckle dusters for the hand yeah. <laughs> Welcome new member Christy Ransbottom to the channel. Glad to have you here. Oh, oh shadow there's so the horrible. Judge Shadow Dance. Cat from the Kong says, going to put my freshly minted member face into a pillow now because it's a school night, kids. Happy spooking love from the Kong. Thank you. Thank you very much. That's Hong Kong to you and me. <laughs> oh, I... No, I was going to say the lights flicker when the people are near them, maybe. No, they flicker, oh. flicker the whole time, it seems. Oh, it's not like the Silent Hill radio static or something. No, that would be useful. That Any, would be anything useful. that would tell me whether I'm going to get jumped by one of these yeah. horrible monsters. Right, is this... BC Rix 94 or possibly BCRix94 says, are we still doing book recommendations because I just finished Small Town God by T.M. Bruce and it was great spooky mystery read for the holiday. Nice. Uh, that sounds there good. There you go. Book recommendation if you're after one. All right, thank you. Okay. That is... Small town god. Cells. Cells. S no, I think that's going backwards, isn't it? Andy, basically? we're facing opposite directions, so it looks like we're putting our heads together to like whisper yeah, about my. Yeah. Like, anyway, I think he's playing. He's playing it all wrong. If you ask me. Andy, I've spent the whole time crouched. That's what you'd be doing as well. Don't pretend yeah, you wouldn't. That's true. That is true. Right. Oh, Luthien says Jane is right there. The light flickers when a zombie is near. I don't know that that was my theory, but apparently it's right. Oh, so... Whitehall, <laughs> Whitehall is where all the bad, bad guys yes. are. Oh, yes. I think this is where we wanted to be, Whitehall. Yes. Oh. Because one of them took a thing to right. Whitehall. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So I said that the lights flicker and then everyone was like, yeah, Jane's right. Yeah. Cool. <laughs> cool. Yeah. Monster Noodle says, can you say hi to my puppy Teddy? He hasn't worked out where the voices are coming from yet. He's adorable when he's confused. All right. Oh, hi Teddy. Hi Teddy. Teddy. Hey, Teddy. Hey, Teddy. Teddy. Over here, Teddy. 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 Treats. Yeah. Treats. Oh dear. Oh, that's oh, just cruel. That's cruel. <laughs> now you have to give Teddy treats or he'll be very upset. Right. This is where all the bad, bad prisoners okay, are. Okay, welcome to yeah, Whitehall. But also where the cells are. As opposed so. to those nice prisoners who were... The only way out is through. All right. Ah, number, number five. We want cell house number five. Cell door number five. Do, 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 do. <laughs> people know number five anymore? Night gown in my life. <laughs> number seven. Oh. You're going the wrong way. Yeah, I, it's probably, I have to prove to come round, don't I? There's a screeching. <laughs> what are these ones? Eight. Little bit of yeah, you're going the wrong way. in my life. But there was no... Uh, right, it must be on the other side, mustn't it, number five? Mm -hmm. So I'm just arcing around, hoping there's not going to be any of those baddies there. What about do, this one? Do, do, number five. Yes! yes! Cell house number five. Oh. It's all right. It's just the game getting confused, I think. Do Imagine the one lock. of those YouTube like two-hour audio videos that's just like, all the ambience oh, yeah. in which cradle. <laughs> no, oh, two you. hours. Lo-fi horror. For yeah, lo-fi horror to study to. <laughs> Just to keep you on your toes. 
Corvus Albright says chipping in for a spooky Jaeger bomb specifically for Andy to consume later. Thank <laughs> nice. you, Corvus. How do they make it spooky? Is it pumpkin spice? It's Jager already bomb? like a it's a very dark colour. I yeah, bet a pumpkin spooky. spice Jaeger bomb would be really tasty actually. Uh, Nathaniel says MLG door unlocking. Mm. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Look, air at horn, air horn. Look at this. Look at the speed. Look at this sheer speed. Oh, I've gotten stuck on the last one. Uh oh. Your hubris. There we go. That's the one. Right. Oh, ah. telescope. That's nice. I'm just going to shut this and door. I know they can open doors, but it makes me feel better. Yeah. Look a little uneven. Yeah. Someone did some amateur work. All right, judgy. What's this? Judgy What's going Garrett. on here? What's uh, this? That's okay. They've scratched the face out of. Why mm. is it? They've been looking at this painting with a telescope. Oh. The staff blamed him for what happened to me. They were wrong. What, who was okay. to blame then? So did you just get the nightgown? Yeah, yeah. I just yes. I pulled it out of the hole in the wall. It was bricked up in this. Right. Thing. right, right, right. Okay. Now we little, need to find little the cheeky save. In the little cheeky little save. Little cheeky save. Just a cheeky save. You know, in a horror game, when it's going to pu punish you for making some pro progress. Yeah. Exactly. Exactly that. You had it good for too long, Mike. Now you must be. Oh, punished. you think you're making some progress, do you? Did we have we found the morgue yet? I don't know, we no, found, we we're found gonna that. go to the morgue to burn the dress. We found that furnace. Oh, the, yeah, but that the morgue will be down the lift, won't it? You know that lift? Yes, yes, I think you're right. Yeah, so I called the lift, but I didn't get in it. No. Okay. Andy, you're not helping. You're not Sorry. helping. Kill them all, Jason. <laughs> Make them suffer. Why is his mum. That's a very Englishy accent you're doing there. This is my main thing. His mum's English. Right. So uh, the lift is around is that, here somewhere, okay, isn't right, it? But it's near that. Wall. It's near that one who goes to and from the light. Yeah. But I can't remember where the light is, or him. So. Isn't that the light there? No, no there's loads of them. There's loads of them. Oh, um, okay. Well, if the light's not flickering, there's then no don't zombie. Don't be bickering. Yeah. There you go. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's the one word that rhymes with that. But they, cricketing. I mean, if the light is flickering, don't start cricketing. That I don't oh. want to go past that. Uh, it's this way, isn't it? It's this way, isn't it? Yeah, I'm just I'm not floor. going near that corpse because it's woken up twice already, and yeah. who knows what it'll do. It's around here, isn't it? The lift. It's around here. It's only bloody around here. <laughs> that's the that's the light he dances in front of. I think. So. Here's the lift. And I'm just and now a simple case of getting in it and pressing the button getting in it to go to the, the morgue. Which will surely be on the lowest level. There's the furnace. There's yes. there's the there's guy hanging out in front of the furnace. Oh. Can he not be can we not just tip him bodily into the furnace? Oh he's moved. He's moved. So He's moved to the left. He's he's working his way around the room. Alright, while we're here, don't forget to search the body drawers for a bag of gold teeth. <laughs> right, okay, fine. Oh he's going up the stairs! Oh, perfect. That works right. for me. Okay, you've got time Bye, while sucker. he goes up the stairs. Oh, no, I'm going to need to escape by ladder and it's not going to work. <laughs> He's going to come and get me. Oh, no, oh, a yeah. worst nightmare. Are any of these things bags of teeth? No. No, I think it's going to be in like a body drawer, isn't it? Boom! Yay! My nightgown's gone. But the Shall I try and go up the ladder? Or is it? He's coming down. He's coming down. I'm going the other way. Go the other way. Go the other way. You have to go into the past. Into I have to go into the past? Oh, no. We've got to time travel. It's the only way. This is the worst. You have to pretend to be one of the patients so the cradle won't see you. Okay, we're going to have to pretend mm. to be a Shellbridge patient. Each of the patients from Whitehall had a favorite toy that they liked. You can use them as keys to go into the cradle's memories. Find one of those. I'm going to myself here. And I'll tell you what oh, it's to flickering. Do next. Mike, it's flickering. Yeah. That means there's a monster. Doesn't uh, it? Uh, no, I, it can't always Atmos. mean there's a monster. No, sometimes they Because there's a lot of flickering going on. All right. I'm going to save because I feel like we made good progress. We've only got about 20 minutes left. So, oh, no. okay. Well, all right. Let's just carry on then. You need to go and get a toy from one of the cells. Yeah. So back where we were, just... Does that mean I have to pick a load more locks? Maybe. Oh. We'll try cell number eight. Should I go back up the lift then, you think? Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. Garrett's like, I'm tired. Ladders are hard. Is he? Is that guy coming up the stairs at all? Oh, uh, middle middle floor. That's where you middle are. Middle floor. Okay. 
<sighs> no? Did it come up? No. Kalasanti Santi again says, oh, yeah. Flash Bomb and Explosive Mine can kill undead, Mike. Do you have any left? Or nope. did you throw all of them at I've the got start? loads of Flash Bombs, but I don't, I, I don't know if I've got any Explosive Mines or not. You could use Flash Bombs. Hmm. Let me just double check I'm not going to walk directly out into a baddie. Okay. Okay. We're fine. We're all good. I'm going to live here for a moment. Moonwalking into a zombie. So you want to see what I've got? I do have... Yeah. I've got five Explosive Mines. All right, well then, let's lay some Explosive Mines next time we come across a zomb. All right, I'll get my uh, I'll get my flash bombs ready. You know? Get your flash bombs. I've to got hand. fourteen of them. Yeah. So you want me to try and get rid of this guy? Yeah, get him, and then we can move around with have impunity. Have you saved? Have you saved? You have. Yeah, I have. Yeah. All right. And oh, then you want happy about it? You want an explosive mine? mine. Lay, lay a mine. Lay a mine. And then get away. Oh, he's Blow up. The... Blow up. There we go. Yes. yes. Nailed In it. In your face. Thanks for the tip. I mean. Is he dead and gone, or is now he give him the tip of this dagger? <laughs> no, I'm gonna just avoid walking over any corpses because okay, I fine. think it's bad. It's bad times for all of us. Uh, okay, so back to the cells. Which way were the cells? Are they over that corpse? <laughs> now I think if you go yeah. to cell number three, you can get a candle, which you have to take to the morgue, and that will get you. Oh, into, okay. Into so the we, we can retrace our steps to okay. the morgue. So I think that's we probably the easiest way of doing this. But hopefully, okay. there's no one patrolling now, so I can just number sprint three. around a bit. Number three. Number three. Do, 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 what the do, heck? Do, 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 do. Haunted fireplace. Oh, I hear, I hear spectral singing. Oh, that's Is nice. that just me? That's no, pleasant. I hear that. Have I lost it? <laughs> la, la. Okay, cells this way. Oh. That's another Andy, lift. If you were gonna, if you were gonna haunt somewhere in two hundred years' time, what present day song would you sing, and what, and that would have a new Mambo Number Five? Spooky... Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Of course, what am I even asking? Um, <laughs> it would be a, a spooky version of Rambo <laughs> number five. Yeah. Or uh, WAP by Cardi B. Uh, okay. In 200 <laughs> years, they'd be like, I don't understand this archaic, ancient... Yeah, this language. Language. Mm. What does it mean? Yeah. <laughs> That's the thing. Like, you know how it's... Um, Victorian kids are all singing like nursery rhymes and stuff yeah. in Ghosts. Mm. So if you're yeah, going to have yeah. like children from this era, they'll be singing like... Uh, chug the, Chug with you and stuff. The theme, yeah. like meme the theme, songs. The theme to Paw Patrol, probably. Uh, number one victory royale, yeah, Fortnite, we about to get down. <laughs> get out of here. Get out of here, Yeah, whereas child. Victorian rhymes were like Ring of Roses, we yeah. all fall down of plague. Yeah. They're like more intrinsically scary. No, it's a guy, it's a guy on your right, it's a guy on your right, it's a guy on your right. <laughs> what, what are you talking about? Okay, he's gone. He walked past. Not in the game, in real life. In real life, oh. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> to the right of your gaming chair. I thought I saw a guy. Maybe I was just jumpy. I think you were just jumpy. I don't. I think we've it cleared. Might have been a, a shade. I think we've cleared this floor out. So, uh, what number? A lot of people suggesting Baby Shark in the comments. <laughs> yeah. Is... <laughs> I mean, sang very slowly yeah. by a small Shots ghost child. That would be. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Imagine fun. a chorus of children singing Baby Shark. What slowly. cell? What cell was the candle in, Andy? Did three. 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 Cell number three. Well, that's number two. So, let's go to number three. Uh, I can't tell if that's an L or an uppercase I. Aisha or Lesha says, Hi, I just want to say I appreciate you all. You kept me smiling through my degree. Currently writing my MSc thesis as I listen to this stream. Cool. Oh, amazing. Well, I hope Good luck on your, your master's thesis. I hope thesis. it's a thesis on haunted... Um, Can haunted you do an MSc children. on haunted houses? Yeah. <laughs> hey, that's a master of spooky creepiness. Ah. <laughs> Cheerful Spider says, the way you're all hunched I keep expecting something creepy and skeletal to emerge from the darkness behind you and smell yeah, your necks. Yeah, me too. <laughs> me too. <laughs> no. Moyer says, if the light flickers, get out of there quicker. Yep, that's, that's right. Good. Yeah. All right. I don't like how little peripheral vision Garrett has while he's picking mm. locks. Yeah, four by three, it's, it's bad. Oh, well, yeah. Imagine having four by three vision. It would nah. be like looking through a box. Now, do we think we want to disturb these chains? Seems no. like a bad idea. Maybe not. They're your classic steampunk tripwires. And now, now simply use a cat's simply agility. Jump you want me to a cat like tread? Simply yeah. jump over it. <clears throat> All right. Well, I'll try. Or throw a flash bomb and see what happens. <laughs> yeah. I think I just stood on it. What's this stuff? Crystals. Oh, there's a candle. There should be a candle in here. There yep. we go. This is Daff used to catch him sleepwalking with that candle. All right, more. and jump. And you go. The toy you just picked up is it's a It's not really a toy, is it? It's a functional thing. Now you have to Everything's a toy to if you have a, the heart a of a child. If you have the imagination. 
the heart's and imagination. Put the toy in the right place, you'll enter the past. All right, get what? back to that morgue. What if I don't want to enter the past? What if but entering what if the I past seems to? like a terrible idea? What's this? That's a. Oh, it's one of the, It's one, another place where you place yeah, another yeah, yeah. toy. But Basically, we know where the as far goes. as I understand it, if you go back into the past, yep. Yeah. If you get caught by a zombie in the past, you get thrown out of the past, and you need to find another toy to return. Oh. Oh boy, okay. that sounds. So don't get. That's my advice. Don't get caught. Okay. Don't okay. get caught by zombies in the past. Yeah. Right. Thanks. I remember the advice my father gave to me. <laughs> don't get caught <laughs> if by you past ever travel zombies. Travel back in time, son. Yeah. Don't get caught by ghosts. Don't get in the caught past. by zombies. Guys, I'm lost again. Uh, I've thrown an explosive oh, mine. Uh, guys, I've thrown an explosive <laughs> mine again. Is there like a Iron Maiden to your left there? Pro probably. Oh, never mind. Iron Maiden. Excellent. Excellent. <laughs> Execute Ooh. them. Uh, one. Okay, that was here. that was cell number three yeah. again. Yeah. Okay, I'm working my way around. Okay. SBH I mean, says, uh, I just want to say I really appreciate you guys. Thank you very much. Thank you. <sighs> Well, thank you. We appreciate, we appreciate all you. of you being yeah. here. All 3,000 of you on a Monday afternoon. 3,000? What, yeah. what do you mean be not very good at this? Feet. We are streaming quite early today. Yeah, it's true. Um, we appreciate you being here so early in the day. Yeah. Or night. Oh. Uh, uh, just uh, edge uh, got along the wall past his legs. There's got to yeah. be another way around, right? Or just um, lay an explosive mine, then wake him up and run away. That You've sounds got risky. Tons of explosive mines. I do, but I, I, don't know, that I don't know how many past zombies I'm going to need. Yeah, that's true. Well, you've only got you've only got like ten or so minutes. You, left. you won't be you won't have your equipment in the past. You'll be in the body of a patient. Ah. Oh right, is that how it works? Well, there you go. Yeah. Even better. I think will it oh, yeah. be like social stealth, Andy? Because we're sort of pretending th to be a patient I think, in the past. I think so. Okay. By the way, if you'd like to see more of this spooky content, then where is he? Where is he? Where is he? Where is he? Content. Where is he? He's there. He's over there. Don't go too far because we're going to be streaming at dead of night to everyone outside extra. After a brief break. Yeah, and, I will um, pop a link in the chat and pin it when we're getting to the end here. Apparently, so can it's a... Yeah. Head on over. Apparently, it's, it's good. Scary. Apparently, it's good and creepy. Scary game. <sighs> just need this guy to move along. You know where he's going to walk? You can always, like, throw an explosive mine where he's going to walk up the stairs there. It's a good idea, actually. Launch it. All right. Launch the mine. How far can I throw these things? As far as possible. <laughs> Go! That didn't work. Oh, not far enough, is it? Wait, if I've got, the range I could do a noisemaker arrow to get him to go over there. Yeah, try, try it. Okay, now he's coming in this direction, I assume. Is he? Don't know. Oh, where is he? He's over is there. He behind that? He's stuck. But he's just, he's not interested in fireworks. He's, oh, he's he's stuck on a ladder, like he's got I stuck on some geometry. I oh, know he's running. Uh -oh. He's running. He's running. Curse you, this game, for having three textures and they all look <laughs> the same. Maybe save it just real quick, just in case. Okay, hold on. I think he's just reset. He's just gone back to his previous pathing. Right, I'm going to save it and I'm going to throw a. Uh, instead of throwing <laughs> a, a bomb where he's going to be, I'm going to throw yeah. a bomb where he is right now. Okay, all right, fine. Also good. That is also fine. Man. Also, thank you, 3,000 people, for, for putting yeah. up with these old ass OG game textures. Right. Um, that are extremely hard to scry under YouTube compression. Uh, 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 go on, blow up, blow up. For pity's sake, blow, please up. blow please, up. Please blow up. Please blow up. I'll be your friend. And explosion? What and is explosion. going on? He's confused. He's confused. Shall I send in a flash bomb anyway as well? Just, yeah. for, just for the lols. Yeah, mix it up. <laughs> Spicy flash bomb. Okay. Didn't like okay, that. Okay, now at he's all, like, then. I can't see anything. I could just rush in and pop the thing in the thing. But I'll be yeah. very close to that explosive bomb thing, won't I? Go on. Go on. Just let him go about his business. He's not harming oh, anyone. Right, yeah. Oh, oh, I think he's... Oh. I think when he's juddering around, maybe he's sort of sensing you. Yeah. Like, you know, in Alien Isolation, where the, yeah. the thing makes noises. Oh, is he going to walk okay. over the, the mine? I don't know what he's doing. No. All right, pop it. I think you pop, pop it on it the, the table. Candle. Oh, on the table, not the, not the furnace. There we go. Oh, I'm in the past. Okay, yeah. now don't get detected, whatever you do. Okay. Oh, you've been detected. This is Wait, but the mines like came through with me as well. It. It's like, <laughs> it's the mine like also an overlay. Through time. Oh, and no, I'm stuck on a ladder. Oh, no. <laughs> the same ladder. The past is even worse. The past is even worse, right. Where do I need to go? Okay. Now will you get my diary? It's all torn apart, 
and we never find all the pages. All right, Laurel. Where's past, your diary? It's just the way I left it, up in the nursery tower. Please find it okay. and burn it in the Going morgue. to the nursery tower. God. Very, very little kids were. Is this the nursery tower? Does this way go to the nursery tower? Oh yeah, that looks like a tower ladder to me. Can you believe uh. they made all those infants climb this this like thirty <laughs> foot ladder to get to the nursery tower? No, it looks like it just goes up one floor. In which case, oh. like I should just take the lift, probably, shouldn't I? STV Pet says hello from my four hundred year old student accommodation in Edinburgh. Who get you? Spooky. This is the first live stream I've caught since moving to the t same time zone as you. Oh yeah. Hi, congrats. STV Pet, welcome. Welcome, welcome to GMT. Or and living in 400 year old student accommodation, that's very cool. Definitely haunted. Guaranteed haunted. Definitely haunted, yeah. Don't mind, don't mind the ghosts. Don't mind the ghosts, yeah. And they won't mind you, maybe. They're more scared of you than you are of them. <laughs> They're like spiders. Yeah. yeah, not sure if that's true. Any idea where the nursery tower is, folks? Um, I mean, it sounds like, oh, there's a, there's a guy. There's definitely a guy. Yep, that's fine. Hang on. Thief, nursery tower. Is. I'm going to save it again because it's in the inner zone from where you start That's... out, go forward until you're at the lobby, then go left. Then in that hallway, hmm, hmm, hmm. that ends the Google pretty. All right, well, we've got seven minutes, so I'm gonna okay. I'm just... It's not too far past the lobby to the east, if I remember correctly. This looks when like a lobby. First, when you first get to the inner cradle, you'll find it blocked off. Spoiler, give me that spoiler. Oh, okay, so you'll be able to get to it now because you're. All uh, right, okay. So go back to the lobby of the inner cradle and then go to the east. Oh, uh, look, where, where's a wax mask to cover his missing features? That was that mask. Oh, that, that was, was that mask we saw on the chair. Oh, okay. That'll be one of the items then. Probably, yeah. Um, one of the toys. I mean, it just seems bad to me, this this whole place. This yeah, and they just shut it, it down. Yeah, you go. Luna7 says, Hail our Lord and Saviour, Hat Andy. <laughs> The safety beanie is protecting me. Right, this is, looks like a lobby. There's someone over there waiting. Oh. Is this way up to They're the nursery tower? Oh, uh, what, is the the, what does the plaque say? Observe oh, observatory. No. To the east, to the east. Follow your compass. Okay, I'm going east. Going east. Garrett has like an oh. inner compass, like a, There's a pigeon. Door there. Door on the left. This is the doorway I just came through, right? Yeah, but is there any other. Are there any signs? It's, it's east from the lobby. Yep. He's from well, the kind of in a cradle lobby. So the, the is that this is this the What's one? that sign? Let's find out. Nursery tower. Yes, nursery, nursery tower. tower. Hooray! Navigation. Now a simple case of picking the lock. Now a simple case of pressing my face up until the lock picking game appears. Or not, or not having any control whatsoever Pick about what's in. going on. Do you still have lock picks here in the past where you're a Maybe not. Or maybe the door's ghost? not locked. It feels locked. Feels pretty locked. It would it would open otherwise. Maybe I need a key to the nursery tower. Do I? Can you search if there's a key for the nursery tower? Because I can't imagine I'd if I don't have any of my equipment, I wouldn't have my lock picks with okay. me either. Really. This is another way in. Blue and Dog says it's my day off. I'm wearing an outfit so cute Jane would approve. And there's a hello stream. Aww, awesome. Well done on your cute outfit. Mm. Okay. Hmm. Have you abandoned the nursery tower? Is there? I just thought there might be a way. Way in, like round here, maybe. How to get into nursery tower? Hmm. Nursery. Okay. Head up the morgue stairs and back out to the nursery tower. Climb it. Easy. It says in brackets. <laughs> yeah, right. Uh, Don't tell me yeah. it's easy, IGN. It, the door won't open. <laughs> it's easy for IGN. Uh, I've got nothing and not nothing. That? Yeah, it's showing me. Mm. It's not. It's showing me not having anything. None of the guides are, are telling me that there's a key. Right. Wow. Is it definitely not up that stair? Is it definitely not the ladder, right? Up, which ladder? You know, the ladder. We're like, no, it can't be up there. No, that that uh, I did check that ladder. It comes back up oh, okay. to where the where the. Ah, I see, I see, I see, I see. So, this is where it pops out here. Okay, fine, 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 fine. So, what's this lift? I don't know. Are there any higher levels? 
No, this is the top. This is the one that goes down to the. Oh, uh, we came up from the morgue. Yes. Yeah. Mm. Confusing. I feel like the lobby would have a key to the nursery tower, maybe. Anything around here? Oh, Dr. Sandbridge. Dr. Sandbridge. Hall of Records. We're we definitely in the past right now. Yep. That's why it's all green. That's why it's all a bit green. Yeah, well, I mean, it's only a green. bit green. Yeah. Before it was a bit grey, now it's a bit green. The past was a bit green, yeah. Hmm. Could go up to the observatory and see if there's anything up there. Okay. No, I can't. There's a man. A man. <laughs> a man. <laughs> uh, uh. What's that on your right? Left. Wait, wait, wait. The man's following What's... me. It's like okay, a book. No there's worries. a bookshelf there. Is that it? I think so. Yeah. Okay. Nothing glowing, so nothing I can pick up. Well, is... I feel like we may be stuck. The past is the matrix. Can you reload? It might be a bug. It could be a bug. It could be a bug. Because I think, from what I'm reading, you should just be able to walk into the nursery tower once you are travelled backwards in time. Um, but clearly you can't do that. Lindsay Bruce in the chat says, just got back from Disney World yesterday and have a little bit of money left over. We appreciate you, Lindsay. We appreciate and envy you to mm. the core of our souls. Yes. Yeah. Although, to be f if you've got back from Disney World with any money, you haven't done it right. <laughs> <laughs> You know you can buy a lightsaber, right? Not for, for ten dollars. Not for ten dollars. Ten dollars. Come on, what can you get for ten dollars in Disney? Uh, half mean, a churro. Uh, bottle of diet coke. <laughs> you could have had a bottle of diet coke. In instead, it's a super chat. So thank yeah. you, Lindsay. Thank you very much. Gosh, Disney World. One right. day. Yeah. Nursery one day Tower. Back there. Nursery Tower. It won't oh, let on, me Nursery open tower. the door. Look. It really doesn't, it doesn't want, want me there. to do it. Is there any other way in there? No. I still look like also. Is this what how the patients are dressed in these games? Like, you as still look like Garrett. Cosplaying as Garrett. I think the game might be somewhat confused. I've or got it, I've got you... no items though, and no nothing. Oh, okay. So. so it does think it does think you're in the past. Mm. Well, and I, it is green. I think we made good progress. I feel like we do need to wrap this up though fairly soon to be. We do. Ready we do because the... we're preparing for another even scarier, if you can believe it, stream over on Outside Extra in but half an hour. Uh, if you get the link, Andy, I've put it on Twitter. But if you grab the link off of Twitter, throw it in the chat, and I will pin it. So There's in always half a bit hour... in every scary game where it just becomes confusing, tedious, <laughs> scary. Yep. Like even PT, the scariest game ever. Like we're going to be playing a very recent FMV game called At Dead on Night, mm. and apparently, it's very even creepy. according to the chat, it's going to be scary Horrible. AF. Mm. Um, yeah, I think this was good though. Like that time when that thing jumped up twice in a row oh yeah was, that was pretty bad. scary the entire thing was pretty tense so um yeah <sighs> i kind of yeah. enjoyed it but it was, yeah it's difficult and awkward and it's, it's a very old, old game it? i'm sure at the it time an old game. when this was the pinnacle of graphical power it would have been the most terrifying thing you ever saw but um mm. yes. cool but yeah come on back in half an hour and we'll be playing um that fmv game it's going to be real scary of night. what's Everyone so hard to, to remember about half an hour of night. Right. take half an hour to calm down go to the bathroom if, yes. if, that, if this has made you need to go to the bathroom, go to the bathroom and we'll see you on Outside Extra in half an yep. hour. Link in the chat and we'll see you then. Bye. Bye. Bye, folks.